Hello, I am Dr. Nathan Glock, a gastroenterologist and member of faculty at the Tel Aviv Medical Center and Tel Aviv University. In this study, we test a novel colonoscope called Aeroscope that possesses a unique panoramic optical viewing system, which we shall demonstrate to you shortly. This system has the potential to visualize polyps behind folds and curves. We assess the ability of aeroscope colonoscopy to identify pseudopolyps implanted in vivo in swine in a randomized blinded study compared to conventional colonoscopy. Although the aeroscope system has many novel features, including technique of navigation and different depiction of the acquired image, my colleagues and I could reach proficiency on it in a strikingly short time period of half a day when training for the study. The principles and novelty of the visualizing system are explained in the following video clip. This is the Aeroscope Colonoscope System, a disposable self-propelled colonoscope from GI View. The Aeroscope System consists of a disposable scanner and a PC-based workstation. The rectal balloon is inflated to seal the anus and the physician gently maneuvers the tube into the colon. The aeroscope has a unique OmniView panoramic camera that helps the physician see and navigate around the term. The scanner balloons are inflated and CO2 fills the space between the rectal balloon and the scanner balloons. As the balloons are gently pushed through the colon by the operator and with aid of the CO2 pressure, their diameter and shape are constantly adjusted to suit colonic anatomy. The Aeroscope's advanced vision system provides two simultaneous views for visualization of the colon, a forward-looking view and an omni-view, which provides simultaneous 360-degree viewing of the mucosal surface ahead of the capsule, behind it, and to all sides. While scanning the colon, polyps are visualized in the Omni view and then the front view. Some polyps, seen behind folds in the Omni view, may not be visible in the front view. Our main finding is that the aeroscope colonoscopy could detect lesions at a rate significantly higher than conventional colonoscopy, missing fewer lesions. This was true overall, but, importantly, also in lesions larger than 6 mm. The procedure was safe, with no adverse events, and full intubation was achieved in all cases. If you would like to hear more about this novel colonoscopy system and view the exciting results of our study, I encourage you to visit Colon Cancer Screening Poster Session on May 4th.